What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Team Fish Nuggles YouTube channel. This is round number one of the Limitless Tournament. And in round number one, we're playing against a Pixie base deck. Very, very interesting. And I'm excited to see his deck in action. So the way this deck works is you have Yixie, which has the ability Secret Territory. As long as you have Mesper and Asim who play, apply weakness for each Pokemon, both yours and your opponents, for four times weakness instead. Uh, you have the Mesper, which does make it where your opponent has no resistance, and Portal as of doesn't really do anything. <laughs> uh, so what you do is you use Alter Creation GX, so you do additional 30 damage and take an extra prize card, and then based on the different decks you play against, you attack, hit for four times weakness, and uh, you should be one-shotting pretty much anything in this format. Uh, take another edition of prize cards, and then maybe uh, get another one out. So let's look at the attackers. We have Ewa's Hall GX, which has Absorb Vitality, which does 20. Heal, this, heal from this Pokemon the amount of damage you do to your opponent's active Pokemon. So once again, if you do the plus 30, that is 50 times 4 is 200 damage. Uh... That doesn't knock out Dragapult, unfortunately, but Sonic Evil could. Um, I don't know how that would actually go down, because you can attach Twin Energy to an Evil Tall, so that one seems interesting. Dragapult seems kind of maybe shaky, unfortunately. Uh, Doom Count can just, um, if you put an exactly four damage counters on it, that Pokemon is knocked out. Uh, there is Tapu Lele, which has Sideway, does 20 times the amount of energy attached to your opponent's act Pokemon. So this one could, like, theoretically easily knock out uh, any Arceus, the Agapalkias, because they do need a bunch of energies, and then you hit them for Fairy Weakness. That's a good one right there. Hitmontop has Spinning Attack, which is 50, plus um, the Alter Creation, which is 80, so 8, 16, 24, 320 damage uh, for the Lightning Weakness. There's Moltres with Assisting Heater, does 30, once again, plus the 30 is 6, so 6, 12, 18, 240, um, to take some big knockouts as well. Uh, assisting Heater, the second the cause behind it doesn't matter. The Diddy for setup, of course. There is the Stun Fisk for Lightning Weak Decks. It does Trap trap Bolt 30+. plus. If before doing damage, your opponent's active Pokemon has more eight remaining HP than this Pokemon, this deck does 30 more damage. I imagine most Pokemon are going to have more than 90 HP. And so you do 60 plus the 9, so 9, 9, 18, 27, like 360. That's insane. Uh, Giratina is for that Dimension Break, so you can discard special energies to try to, try to disrupt your opponent. Uh, there is a Kyrim, uh, Frozen Wings is 30, discard special energy, which could be actually pretty good, uh, just on its own. But for Fire Weakness, you have Black Kyrim, and you still have Tapu Fini as well. Uh, this is more for the Basophion, of course. Um, so that's pretty nice. There's Acrobites to help draw cards. A great catcher, bring Pokemon to the bench to the active. Three treasure, of course, to find those psychic Pokemon. You have Ordinary Rod, and this is where I think the combo kind of like goes into play. You like take a knockout, that bop one of your guys, you Ordinary Rod, get it back, take a knockout, bop. Or you just knock out one of their guys and they're trying to knock out a, a Dedini with Hitmontop, which is pretty cool. Uh, catcher brings money up to the active. Quick Ball to find your Pokemon, of course. You have Treasure and Quick Ball to find these um, Pixies, of course. Three switch because your ADP does have a three retreat cost. So they don't knock it out. And that's something you could do as well. You can ultimate rate to try to knock out Dedini and then uh, attack with one of these guys depending on the situation. Tool Scrapper, get rid of tool guards. Their Sky Pillar prevents all effects of your opponent's attacks, including damage done to bench Pokemon. So you can protect your babies. Uh, for Cynthia, for research, there's one air balloon. So you have two less retreat costs, which can help with the RC's Diagopalkia. It also gives all these guys pretty much free retreat, um, even Evotol, which is good. So you can free retreat into the RCS. Two Vitality Man, which I think this is where the numbers like start mattering a lot more, right? Um, let's take, for example, the Evotol, right? So three, six. So now you're doing a lot more damage, right? So you're doing 200. Uh, so five. 5, 10, 15, 20, and now you're doing 6, so 6, 12, 18, 24. Did I do the math wrong earlier on somebody? I think I like said a crazy number for somebody earlier when I did 60. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember. Uh, 4, Roar Energy, uh, Attach 20 Pokemon, of course, Discard a Card, 4 Rainbow, and 3 Twin Energy. The Twin Energy is very nice, uh, but it only seems to work on really the Hitmon top because that's the only one that has the two colors. Uh, but, like I said, Hitmontop can knock out Tadini, so it's very, very good. Because if you can knock out something with RC's Diagopalkia and then Hitmontop, you're good to go. So that's round number one. We'll see the deck in action against uh, our own Picaron. Uh, links are down below to everything. And, uh, yeah, we'll see the match right now. 
Alrighty guys, so round number one, let's start. You just want points deck. Uh so got an ADP in friends list. I'm not sure what this is, but we lost coin club, so we're going second. So I'm actually very interested to see how this deck goes. Alright, so uh let's start peeking wrong. Seems pretty good. We got the speed, the Bolton, Tadini, we got the stuff. Alright. So let's see how this goes. I mean we got a pretty good hand right now. Three Pokemon coming out. There's ADP. Yixi. Okay. Four times weakness. So it looks like he's just like playing a weakness base kind of deck thing. So go Flash. Uh, Electro Power. Electro Power. Bolton V. Um, now the question is. Two, three, six. So we have to hit a. Yeah, we'll go to Dini and discard the hand. Let's see what we got here. We got the Thunder Mountain, got the Coco. Okay. So we can. Electromagnetic. To discard the Quick Ball and the Lightning Energy. We'll grab the, oh, there's Zero Aura is prized. We have two E switches. So we'll go Raichu and Raichu. All right. Put down Raichu, Raichu. Put down Coco. Put down Thunder Mountain. And we'll Sycamore. Oh, we whiffed it. Okay. Hmm. Uh, oh, no, we didn't. We can switch into Dadini. Dance of the Agents to the Picarom. Okay. Gotta select two, so put on the Picarom. Press done. <clears throat> we'll switch back into the Picarom. And we will full blitz. 150. There we go. Do a 210. Put the three on the peak around, or on the the Alolan right here, right? You trying to get that right lightning right up, ready to go. All right. So I was like, we're missing. I was like, why well, we have double E switch? We have double switch in hand. What are you talking about, Josh? You're so bad at Pokemon. Okay. So there is the Aurora energy going to the active. Okay. Uh, discarding the quick ball. So they can alter creation. There's a Sycamore. So it looks like they probably need to get the Hitmon on top. It looks like their person that they want to interest with the mess. Yeah. So you have four times weakness. There he is. Spinning attack is what they're going for. For two. It only does 200. It's not even a. Oh, uh, no, it doesn't. It does a. Uh, uh, five, six, seven, eight, eight, six, twenty-four. It does 320. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, maybe I should have put on the active, and then we could have tag bolted next turn. Like we could have uh, tag bolt this turn if we want to. I don't know. It's gonna be weird, man. Huh? So you take a knockout. And there's a Dadini coming out. Okay, that's good for us. That's good for us. Alter creation. Okay. So see electromagnetic. Um. <sighs> Let's think about this. Do we go into a Picarom? So I can go this for this and this. Press done. Get out Pika. We got two E switches left. Okay, so we go Pika. Pika Lightning. Volkner. We can go E switch. And big charm. Uh, we can just go E switch. I don't want to get the lightning. 
Hmm. From here to here. And then I'll just uh, full blitz for the knockout. Alright. They don't have a Mew in their deck. Which is good for us. So we'll go to three. There's their aura. There's a lightning. And there's a lightning. And we can tag bull next turn to take a knockout and a knockout to win the game. Uh, yeah, there's no Mew in his list. Well, we might see a spinning attack to knock us out. That'd be pretty rad. Yeah, lightning, tag bolt, knock both these out, take three prize cards. Twin energy, this is just, there we go. Not even enough damage. We'll put this down. Um, you have three extra energy, so we'll, we will zero aura, free retreat, and go for tag bolt GX, putting the extra damage there, and there we go, game Number one, take him down a very interesting deck for sure. Uh, he didn't hit the other um, fair, uh, extra pixie. And if he did, he definitely would have took a knockout. That would be really cool to see. But there we go. Round number one done with the Pico Rom deck. Uh, so we'll see you in round number two. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button. And we will see you tomorrow for another Limitless Qualifier round two. Alrighty.